Hello Cancer and welcome to your reading for all the singles out there. Thank you for being here and if you are new to the channel, subscribe, join our family, welcome, we're here for you every day. So I've also done a general reading for all of you. I'm a Cancer so I'm excited for this reading. I've done a Twin Flame reading and this is your singles reading. So if you're single right now, you know, if you want to know what the angels want you to work on, this reading's for you. So I'm going to use two decks of cards. I'm going to use the Everyday Witch Tarot and I'm going to use the Magical Mermaids and Dolphins cards to bring in some water energy. I'm always feeling things before I do the cards. And for you, I'm already feeling that you're going to realise your importance this month. You're going to realise your power. You're going to become stronger. And you're already becoming stronger, Cancer, because you're working on who you are. So in April, you're going to feel better. And you're going to be emitting this light energy, this sexy energy that's going to just draw people to you. So let's see what the angels want you to know. So what do all the singles need to know, please, angels, for April 2020? What do we need to know? Let me split that deck there. What do we need to know for April? I'm taking out anything that's jumping. There we go. For all the single cancers. I want to single the single ladies. That's what's coming in my head, you know. All the single ladies, all the single ladies. And it's because, you know, you've got it going on. And if you watch the reading that I did, the general message for you, it's about you getting it on with yourself this month. You know, you're going to feel good. You're going through changes. And I love this because, you know, this is the crossroads that you're currently at. You know, you're working out what to do, who you are, you're finding your way. So just like the page of pentacles there, you're moving towards a better future. And you're in your power this month, Cancer. You know, there you are, strong and independent, all the single ladies. You're ready for what's to come. They just close throat chakra. So there may be some delayed communications. You know, you may not be able to speak the truth to people this month, but you can certainly speak the truth to yourself and to heaven and be in your power. And your strength and independence is going to help you to realize what's important, that you're important. And people in your life are going to realize just how important you are. Things are going to move forward. You know, things that you may have been struggling with for a while, they're going to get cleared up. So it's showing the power of you. You know, it may take a few times for you to get things right, but you're going to make things happen because the future is in your hands and there's hope for the future there. There's magic within you. When you tune into the power of who you are, anything is possible. And this is a real month for you to plan the future, to think about what you want, to ask about what you want especially in a relationship, to tell the universe, to communicate with the universe the type of love that you were seeking, the type of love that you were desiring and wanting, because the angels are saying that you're ready for love, you're ready to move forward towards love, you know, you're ready for this, you're ready for a new direction, you're ready for change, you're ready for something wonderful to enter your life and there's hope for it now, you know, so if you've been single for a while, it's showing you ready. You know, you've been working on you, you've been finding yourself and it's been a struggle. For some of you, you know, you may be newly single and you're working on yourself and you're feeling it's a struggle. But, you know, you're standing strong, you're becoming the queen of pentacles, you've got it all going for you. So this month I feel abundance for you. I feel loyalty. I feel great things coming in. And it's showing you that, you know, you're rising above fear. You're working through illusions. You're moving through situations that no longer serve you. And you're trusting in the power of love. You're trusting in fate. You're trusting in destiny. You realize there's a bigger picture behind your life and that things are moving forward right now. Changes are coming in. Magic is coming in. And we've got self-employment. So I also feel some of you, will be becoming self-employed. You know, maybe things are changing in the world for you right now. You can't do what you did, so you're making a change. Or maybe now's the time for you to do your self-employed position. You're going for what you want. It's the right time. Fate and destiny is moving this forward for you. And, you know, so for some of you, love won't be as important as work. It's showing you focusing on what you want to do. And that's powerful. That's sexy because that opens doors. And when you let go and allow your life to flow, the universe will bring magic in for you. 
So if you're single right now, the angels are saying to you, you're a born entrepreneur and your business is surrounded by magical opportunities. So there's magical opportunities coming in for you right now. Magical opportunities and change. But watch your thoughts. Remember, what you think about, you bring about. So if you're being a bit negative about things, worrying about things, you'll bring more of that energy in. Instead, send that out the window. Trust that you're safe, you're where you need to be, that you can work on you right now. And think about what you desire, not what you fear, and it will bring in magic for you. And trust in the synchronicities, that everything will work out when it's meant to. That everything has been aligned for you, orchestrated for you, and sorted out for you now. So if you are meant to meet someone, you'll meet them, whether it be online or just going to the shop. And I know that's hard right now, but things will align. The universe will bring you what you need at the exact right time for you. So this is about trusting in that power. Your prayers and questions are being answered by synchronistic events. Notice them in order to increase their flow. So the angels are saying to you, you're going to be shown lots of signs, synchronicities and powerful things this month that show you you're on the right path and you're where you need to be. So keep your thoughts positive, trust that things will get better and know that fate and destiny are moving things on. They're giving you power. You've got the number 10 there for power and signs and optimism and standing strong and trust that you know if you want to be self-employed if you want to do something for you this is the exact right time so see through the illusion see through the fears and trust in who you are because you were strong like the queen of pentacles you were strong independent successful and you don't rely on others to give you what you need because you know that you can prepare yourself with what you need you can be exactly what you need and you know sometimes you're a bit too caring and too nice and you know you can get walked on a little bit but the angels are showing you not anymore you're in your power and because of that it's bringing in new direction new beginnings and new love so get ready for love Plan what you want. Think about what you want. Start using gratitude as an attitude. Start writing your feelings down, writing your plans down, communicating with heaven about what you want and they will bring in the most beautiful future because there is hope for the future for you, Cancer. Great things in your future. So rise this month and keep the faith and know without a doubt that you are loved, safe and all the blessings and magic that you've been asking for is on the way. Have a beautiful day, a magical month, and I'll see you soon.